Okay, so on today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up the um, R4 um, 3DS GoPro Revolution uh, card. Um, this will basically work for any DS system, so the regular DS, uh, DSi, um, DSi XL, and all the 3DS models. Um, I'm going to be leaving you a link in the description. Um, for the files that, that I made. So here it is here. Um, this will basically have the kernel. Um, it's going to have a few applications. Um, it's also going to have um, different emulators already set up. Um, so the emulators are going to be Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, and regular Game Boy, um, regular Nintendo, um, all the Sega systems, and the Super Nintendo, and then the DS. Um, so once you go into the folders, um, it already come with the emulator, already set up. So there it is for each one. Um, so all you have to do is uh, drag over your ROMs um, to the root of, the, of this folder and just go from there. Um, now we're going to get over on the uh, DSi. That's what I'm going to be using today. And um, I'll show you how to run it and set it up. Okay, now over on my uh, DSi. Um, so this is the card I'm using. The uh, 2024 R4 Gold Pro. Um, so if you're using this card, this video is for you. Um, so it's got my uh, micro SD, 32 gigabytes. Um, you can use up to 256 uh, gigabytes. That's what I've tested so far and it seems to work. So just put it in the slot, put it in your um, DSi or 3DS or whatever system you're going to use. Um, just power it on. So there you go. Um, it'll be touch a Bomberman Land Nintendo. All you gotta do is press A to load it up. And there you go, there's the um, r4isdh.com menu. Um, you can get custom themes for this, but I just left it as uh, as is. Uh, make sure your date on your uh, uh, DSi or DS is uh, current to today's date, or it might give you an error. Um, so it's got uh, games, multimedia, and then your settings. So to go into the emulators and the games, just go under game, press A. And there you go. So all your um, uh, DS ROMs will uh, show up in the main menu. And then also all your emulators. So GBA Runner, DS games, and then um, uh, Super Nintendo emulator, Genesis, uh, Nintendo, and so on. Um, so I'm just going to load a uh, DS game quickly just to show you that it works. So we'll do New Super Mario Bros. Press A to load it. Should be pretty quick. And there you go. It starts up right away. Um, go back to the menu. Just um, pull down power lightly. It takes you back into the main screen. Um, go back into it. And I'm going to show you one emulator just so you see that it works. Uh, game. Uh, we're going to do the Sega emulator. That's where I added the one game. So there it is. Uh, Ace Nest DS. Press A to load it. And 
And this is where your ROMs are going to be. Sega ROMs. And then this is where it's going to be. Um, back out, same thing, lightly. And it takes you back into the main menu. Um, so I've created a um, link. I will post it. Um, it'll basically have everything you need to um, get this card going. Um, so uh, lastly, um, this is my last video for the year. Um, I would like to thank everyone um, who subscribed and uh, made comments and liked all my videos. Um, I will be making more in 2024. Um, so thank you for subscribing. Uh, thank you for watching. And um, on to the next one.